YouTube, your boy Caleb Harris back in the building. As you can see here, it's LeBron James, and uh, I'm about to react to Trojans versus the uh, for St versus Stanford. I guess uh, really here to watch Brownie, but I did not know LeBron James would be in the building. LeBron just lived a lot to me, honestly. I mean, God, my gosh, I mean, this is not even about LeBron, but bro, the dude doesn't care anymore. Go to his, uh, his son's college games just to go see him. His uh, Bryce's high school game. He was getting his bag a couple of years, and then he was retired. He got his freaking Nike thing. He, bro, this guy, he's good. So, pretty sure he's going to be like, end up like MJ. But anyway, let's check out this video, see how Brian did. Look at LeBron. Got the James family. What is that? Wait. That conversation. What other conversation? Oh. Yeah, he, he might be that guy, to be honest. If y'all know what a black family is, this is a black family supporting each other. That's what we do. But, uh, see how they do. I like Brian come off the bench like a six man. He, I don't know if he's still on man restriction. But, uh, USC is not bad. Uh, I mean, they just sometimes lose stupid games. Oh. Wow, that guy, last time I reacted to a video, they were going against Auburn. He's so, like, crazy. Nice shot. Nice, nice shot, man. Is Brian the game? No. Ooh, what kind of jump shot was that? <laughs> My gosh. Boogie Ellis. This guy here is tough. This is LeBron's uh, recruiting. Isaiah Collard. <laughs> but nah, that's crazy. Boogie Ellis. He might. Oh. Boogie Ellis might uh, what's called go to the draft next year. I mean, he's uh, been in the college for a good minute. That's a good dunk. I mean, why is he trying to foul him? That was a slow spin move, but anyway, he just gah, dunk it on his head. Is Bronny in the game? Yeah, he's in the game. There he is. That's tough. Tough layup. I don't know who's on Stanford, to be honest. What the? That's a tough shot, and gets the bounce. Wow. I want to see how Brownie is uh, shooting the ball and everything. Oh, yo. Alright. I don't underestimate that guy. He's making shots now. Guys, give, give players time. Isaiah Collier. That dude's tough, man. He's a good uh, driving in the paint dude. He's a good shooter, too, but his main stuff is driving in the paint, and he's strong. Offensive. How is that offensive foul, bro? This dude doesn't know what he's talking about. That offensive foul. He went into the body. He didn't extend his arm, bro. That's just big body. Big body buttons. Big body buttons. It's right open. That's it. Nice, nice screen and roll. Nice screen and cut or whatever it's called. Back door or whatever. Uh, but uh, I don't know everybody on USC, but I do know... They got some shooters. <laughs> Boogie Ellis, another three. I'm pretty sure he's going to declare for the draft next year. If he doesn't, uh, how many years can you be in the freaking college portal and college basketball? Like, how long? Why are they showing these replays? Who cares? Good pass. They don't need another pass. They don't need another freaking replay. It's a little pass, okay? Chris Walton, 39-37. Isaiah, ooh, come here, a little hezzy, that was a foul, and one, ooh, that could have been a steal, 44 to 47, ooh, could have been a travel, I don't know if he used his pivot foot, he looked like he got off clean, why are they showing these replays, he got his pivot foot, his other foot just slipped, bro, why are they showing these replays, good passing, but bro, let the game go, uh oh, 
Alley oop? No. Boogie? Good pass. That's uh, that dude, that dude barely jumped, but that's the uh, Dennis Ramos son. Good pass. Good pass, mate. All right, USC. But when y'all go against the top tier team like Auburn, can y'all get it done? I don't know yet. Still, good job, Ronnie. Good pass ahead. Uh, cut it off. Hey, well, why they got the the? Why they got this the, the, the score like? Oh, right there. Big man shooting threes. Never thought I would see it. Oh, I could have been still. I got on defense. Uh, white boy shooter. That's one of the best noises to hear. Like a, like a, like a rapture sound. 66-65. A closed game. Oh. All right, boy. Kobe. What are you talking about Kobe for? Isaiah. Good pass. Boogie. Nice shot for Boogie. I'm telling you, bro. He probably going to go to the draft next season. That's the next season, but next draft. Isaiah caught. He might be clear for the draft, too. That's tough. That's good. Them pick and rolls are tough, but um, tough to guard because you don't know if they're going to. Drive it or just go around it, but he just went around and shot three. Hey, good fake, but okay, give me that. I bet LeBron's like, put Brian back in him or sue you. <laughs> the coach, like, I gotta win games, man. Good defense. Oh, cutter. Boogie. Tough mid range. This guy is tough, bro. I remember when he played with Bronny and, not Bronny, but LeBron and, um, what's called. And Julie, Isaiah, oh, good fake. That's tough, mate. Tough. Glad they're going to win this game. One minute left. Put Brian back in, bro. Oh, he's in the game. That's tough. Yeah, that's, 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 for defense, that's too much of a gap for him to drive in. You have, you, you have to stun and recover. He didn't even stun. He barely stunned, bro. And that bad defense anyway. Bad ball pressure. Yeah, buddy, you're going to get cut after that. Yeah, Stanford might be not that team. Bro, come on, bro. You can't, I just... You can't... Oh, my gosh. You're dribbling too much, bro. If you're going to get in the game in the last possession, do something. Anyway, I guess Brian again... Brian didn't do... Oh, my gosh. My computer is sounding like a freaking refrigerator. Calm down. But anyway... Uh, Brian James, uh, I wanted to see him score or something like that. This game, a couple of games, he uh, was kind of had his best game against somebody. Uh, I think it was the, this team. He did pretty good. But um, but the USC Trojans, they looked pretty stacked and good. Um, they lost a couple of games, though, that they shouldn't have lost. Um, you know, those games, Brian weren't in. But uh, they're starting to, you know, get stuff together. Uh, Bronny pulled up to that game. Uh, he also pulled up to Bryce's game. But, um, yeah, Bronny, uh, not Bronny, LeBron is a supporting father, and uh, he's in his last couple years in the NBA, so that's why he's probably trying to get and watch uh, Bronny, because I don't think Bronny's going to declare for the draft, pretty, pretty sure he won't, if he does, that's stupid, or LeBron gets him a guaranteed team, and LeBron's leaving LA, but um, that's probably not going to happen, he's probably going to stay one more year, probably going to start next season, um, or something like that. Um, and do better, have confidence, he's still trying to get, dude, you know, if y'all don't know how bad that, that, uh, what's called, um, that, uh, cardiac arrest was, bro, that is your heart stop, so it's, he basically died, so he's getting back to you, that's, that stuff is dangerous, so, he's still trying to get stuff back into him, his blood flows and everything, is just, just trying to get back in everything, but so, next season, he'll probably be better, but, um, yeah, some guys like Boogie Ellis and Isaiah Culler, I can see them declaring for the draft. Uh, if they, I can see Boogie Ellis declaring for the draft and then Isaiah Culler, same for one more year if he wanted, but he can declare for the draft if he wanted. But, um, yeah, bro, that's what I got to say about this video. Uh, like it, subscribe to this channel. And, uh, until next time, stay humble, stay blessed. This is your boy Caleb Paris, NSH Network. It's out in the field.